Hey guys, what's up? It's Ben. I'm back with another vlog and this one is very exciting. So recently I've been buying uh, quite a few more parts for the Z. We've got from the last video, we've got the carbon fiber interior that's all getting dipped. We have uh, some long tube intakes being made. That's in the engine bay, there's, uh, the engine is twin intake, so there's some big tubes that'll come all the way down from the engine into the front of the bumper with some big pod filters on the end. Um, and then after the tune, those intakes alone are going to create about another 30 horsepower and the exhaust and the tune is going to create another 30 on top of that. So estimating about a 60 horsepower increase um, and a lot of good changes to throttle response. Uh, maybe a few flames, a lot more pops and bangs from the exhaust, so very excited about that. But right now, um, probably the most exciting box just came in. Uh, I'll show it to you. So this is a very big box. The box is about the size of me. Um, I'm very surprised because this is from AliExpress and it took about six days to get here. I did pay, I think it was $150 for shipping, but that's pretty good speed. You know, even if you know, buy something from the US for that much, it won't be here, that's quick. So very happy with that. Also, this is some new stuff. I've already unboxed it, it came a few days ago. This is from DND Interior. Very nice aftermarket steering wheel here. Um, they did not send me the horn button with the bolts, so I messaged them on Facebook and they very quickly replied and they're sending me an upgraded carbon fiber one um, like for free. So very happy about that. Hopefully that should be here soon, so I won't be installing this for another maybe week or two until that button comes. Uh, this is the this is the hub to actually attach the wheel. So you've got the wires here to um, basically you take out the airbag um, and then you put these wires in so that there's not a constant engine light or not engine but airbag light. You know it doesn't think that there's an an airbag exploding or whatever. So those are just to cancel out the light. Uh, the horn looks cool. That's the horn and the fucking airbag wires. And then this hub just goes where the steering wheel used to be and then bolts into here obviously so this is going to be really nice it's going to be much better to grip my steering wheel doesn't have uh, if you've been in a 50z before it doesn't have the cruise control buttons on mine anyway so i don't need those buttons i'll i will not have an airbag um, in the steering wheel but i'm not too worried honestly i'm not planning on crashing the car and i have uh, quite a few other airbags surrounding me anyway so i should be right hopefully <laughs> And then here we've got a very cool um, addition. These will not be going on for quite a while because soon I'm getting my wheels um, completely sanded, repainted, everything. New, um, I'll do a video on it, you'll see. But these are some brand new lug nuts. These are from a little company called My Project NZ, and these are some spiked lug nuts. So they're really cool. You can take the end off so that it's easier to, you know, put the drill bit on and take them off. And then you also have the uh, the key to it here, so that goes onto the wheel. And you can basically, in fact, I think you take. So this is how it sits on the wheel. Get that in nice and tight. And it's all got, you know, it's all made out of uh, aluminium, I think. So, you know, it's not going to come apart. It's got uh, rubber washers inside, so they don't fall out while you're driving. But, you know, so it's just like on the wheel like that, it's pretty big, they're going to look really good on the new um, wheel colour. And then you just take that off, and it's also got a key. So, these are a lot harder to steal, I mean, I guess you could technically just walk up to the car and pull these off. If you see me at a meet, please don't. <laughs> um, you know, these are easy to take off, but if you wanted to take the actual wheel off, like, for example, my wheels are some three-piece work wheels, worth a few grand so you would need a piece like this to go on you need to take off a little other bit you need to go on and then you can take the wheels off of the drill bit or anything. so yeah really happy with those um those were quite a good deal actually i think they were that doesn't go there oh it does um i think they're about a hundred dollars from uh my project nz so thanks for those you can just get those on trade me um, so very handy, they came in about two days. So if you're looking for some spike lug nuts, I had a few people message me on Instagram looking for, focus camera, looking for some of these. So looks like really nice quality. And I'll show you guys more about them when I do the um, new wheel color reveal and all that. So yeah, if you're looking for some of those, my project on Trade Me. 
Yeah. Right, but now we've got the big box. No one knows what this is. Well, I put it on my Instagram, so you might know what this is. This box is massive. It's the biggest box I've ever had for my car. It is almost the size of me. It weighs nothing though, so it weighs very little. So you might be able to guess what it is. This is a big, big focus. This is a big, big carbon fiber wing for my car. Very excited about this one. Uh, let's get into the unboxing. This thing actually came out really quickly. I got this from AliExpress, um, which I actually get a bit of my carbon fiber parts from for the Z. AliExpress is usually known for being pretty shit quality, but I make sure to my best ability that the parts are really good quality and I have some reviews. This one had zero reviews, so hopefully it's alright. Um, but it got here in about a week's time, which is very quick for AliExpress. This is a big knife, I know. Um, I've also had about four copies today, so that's why I'm talking so fast, so I apologize. Anyway. It's packaged pretty well actually. They've got on the ends here, they've got a lot of uh, padding around the tip of the wing. So I'm pretty happy with the packaging. Hopefully it's not damaged at all. I mean, with AliExpress, they're pretty safe anyway. Um, especially if you're videoing it while you're unboxing it, you can just send them the video and they pretty quickly give you a refund. They're pretty good about it. This looks sick. Okay boys, this thing looks fucking mint. Look at that. Carbon fiber looks so good. Really nice weave. I haven't seen any defects really so far. It looks really nice. It's got a good clear coat on it by the looks of it. So this wing, it's not as massive as I thought actually at first, but it's a lot bigger than my current one. That's about six or seven, I'd say, inches. So it's a lot bigger, it's gonna add a lot of depth to the back of the car. Looks really good. It's quite big in terms of size. So it's gonna sit about like that on the back of the car, but like that, it's gonna look really good. So I did think from the pictures that this wasn't really squared off this part. They made it look like it was a bit more of a with a fin, but honestly, I'm pretty happy with it. There's no defects, really nice quality, good clear coat on it by the looks of it. Really nice. Even the back of it, like the back of it's been, you know, painted so you can't see the, you know, the inside of the, the fiberglass, the weave. I think it's probably, how these parts usually come, it's usually fiberglass, I think with a carbon fiber you know, resin on top, because um, it's not ultra, ultra light. Um, so, yeah, but as you can see, this is where the Nissan badge goes, um, and we might cancel the 350 letters from the back of the car, the Fairlady Z, I think it is, from the back of the car, once we put this on. But damn, I am very happy with that. That is awesome. That is so cool. It'll be, Probably another week or so before I get this on the car. The cars are waiting, the intake's made right now, and um, and the headlights are getting redone and everything. Next time you see this, it'll be on the car. The headlights will be done, the intakes will be done. The tune, not quite yet. It's about a month long wait for the tune, but the steering wheel will be in. Lug nuts won't be on. But you know, next while we'll do install, wing, headlights, intakes, steering wheel. It's gonna be sick, boys. So. Stay tuned. If you haven't already subscribed, subscribe because we've got some big things coming for the Z. We're going to be spitting flames very soon. So um, let me know what you think about the wing and about the wheel and everything down below. And I'll see you next time. Cheers.